Hey guys, it's Jamie and welcome back to my channel and Merry Christmas slash Happy Hanukkah slash Happy Holidays slash I hope you had a great Sunday if you don't celebrate any of those. I am here to film my Christmas haul for 2016. I did one of these last year and it was really well received by a lot of you guys and a lot of you guys requested on my Instagram that you would like to see another Christmas haul this year so that's what we're going to be doing today. <laughs> disclaimer I'm not gonna show you guys everything that I got for Christmas because I got quite a bit of doll stuff but I also got quite a bit of like regular stuff like for me um and the f fact of the matter is or the fact to why I got so much stuff this year is because Christmas is like the one day of year where I'm absolutely spoiled and um, I get a ridiculous amount of stuff and it's crazy and I'm very very grateful for everything that I get because I know I get a lot of Christmas presents. Um, so if you have a problem with that you can just leave. But yeah like I said I'm not going to be showing you guys everything that I got for Christmas um, because it would t we would be here forever <laughs> and um, I have to leave in a couple minutes anyway. So I'm just going to show you guys the doll stuff that I got. Um, but if you guys would like to see the rest of the stuff that I got for Christmas, just leave a comment down below telling me that you would like to see, you know, like absolutely everything that I got for Christmas, and I will be sure to film a part two to this. Let's get started and stop stalling. So the first thing that I got for Christmas, obviously standing in front of you, are my new dolls. Three out of four of these dolls are brand new. This doll right here, um, the colorful, colorful hair doll is my old Marie oh my god I have the hiccups is my old Marie Grace um, who I ripped the wig off last night and put a new wig on and the reason for that is that I got a new Marie Grace literally when I opened her up yesterday I was not expecting to get another Marie Grace it was crazy I was so excited um, but I've been asking for a new Marie Grace forever um, this Marie Grace is in perfect you know new in box condition whereas my Marie Grace was a little rough and I had a wig laying around, you know, I didn't need two Marie Graces, so I thought might as well make a costume. So I don't have a name for her yet. If you have any name suggestions, be sure to comment them down below. But um, this one's name is just going to say Marie Grace. And then I got Truly Me 64 from Santa. Uh, Truly Me 64, um, her name is Francine. I'm going to call her like Franny or Francie or anything like that for short. Um, but she's my little like French girl. I'm gonna make her from France. She's really cute um, And then on the end here we have truly me 26 and Truly me 26 I decided to name her Jules after one of my or one of the characters from Pulp Fiction um, And she's very cute. I have a Julie and a Jules, but That's Jules and she's really 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 cute. And I really recommend her so if you guys would like to see any reviews on any, on any of these dolls, you know, besides my custom, again, feel free to comment them down, comment them down below. Um, but I also got all of the outfits that they're wearing from for Christmas as well. Marie Grace's, this Marie Grace's outfit is from So Cute Forever on Etsy. Um, Francine's outfit is from American Girl. It's like the sparkle sweater outfit. This Marie Grace's, who I don't have a name for yet, outfit is from So Cute Forever as well. And then Jules' outfit is from SC. I don't know where though. The next gift I received that I'm actually using right now is my new lens, and I'm so excited. It's a 24 millimeter uh, 2.8 lens. It's from Canon, and it's so nice. I'm using it right now, and it's a wide angle. And most of my lenses are portrait lenses or like uh, telephoto lenses, so they zoom in. And I've been needing a wide angle lens, and this is perfect. And I'm traveling in May, like internationally traveling, traveling, and this will be perfect because it's really small and compact. But I'm really excited because I wasn't expecting a new lens at all. So now I'm going to go into the Art Generation stuff that I got. And I got quite a bit of Art Generation stuff, which I'm so excited about because I think Art Generation stuff is so freaking cute. But anyway, I got the Cutest Pie Kitchen Playset, and it's so cute. It comes with all kinds of stuff that you would need for baking there's not like a lot of fake food in here but it's more like ingredients and instruments that you would use to bake 
Here's a close-up of everything. I don't know what that is, but there's like a towel and a pot and uh, tongs and a ladle and like cups filled with liquids and the scale and pears. It's a really, really, really cute set and I'm really excited to use it. Next we have a outfit and it is the Reach the Top outfit by Our Generation. I'm having to hold it since it'll fall over once it's on its own. But I actually picked out this outfit a couple days ago and my mom just wrapped it. <laughs> but um, it's really cute. It comes with like a vest and a baseball hat and a shirt and all that kind of stuff. And I think it's really cute. It's one of the cutest outfits our generation has released recently and I'm so excited to use it. We have the business class outfit by our generation and oh, I think this outfit is so cute. Um, I woke up on Christmas morning obviously and this outfit was right next to Francine and that's like what made me want to make her French doll because I, when I like this outfit I think of a 1960s French film of like a girl traveling you know what I mean like that's what I think I think of a French girl and I think it's the cutest outfit I've ever seen I love this outfit I'm all for like retro things so I love their retro line and yes that's an outfit that I got and then we have another retro outfit and it is the pajama rama and it's so cute it comes with these pajamas and it's a top and some shorts and bunny slippers and a little doll and I think this is very very cute and I can't wait to put it on one of my dolls so we have some more sets by our generation and by the way <laughs> this is not sponsored by our generation I know that I got a lot of our generation stuff like a lot of our generation stuff um, but my Christmas was not sponsored by our generation um, I just really love the brand and my mom knows I love it my dad knows I love it like Santa knows I love it like you know um, so I just love the brand so I got a lot of our generation stuff Next, I got this Museum Day um, little playset. I don't know what to call it, but so it's funny because I gave this away. I had a giveaway on my Instagram for the holidays, and this was the first place prize. <laughs> but it's just funny because I gave this away and then I got it as a gift. But it's really cute. It comes with a working flashlight and some glasses and a backpack and a map and a magnifying glass. I don't know. It's really, really cute. Next, I got the Season Pass set. Again, this is one of the... You can see me in the glasses. But it's awkward because I look terrible but um uh I all this is one of the things where I picked out in the store and my mom was like I'll just wrap it <laughs> so yeah it's really cute it comes with a fake pretzel fake drink sunglasses a watermelon bag and back there is like a poster and like a ticket or something I don't know it's really cute though next we have the real cool set and oh I was so excited to get this because um I've been like looking at all of the targets near me and I couldn't find this anywhere but I got it for Christmas I was so excited but it comes with a video camera that has a viewfinder with an image a little director's board and a reel of like film back there it's so cute and then next we got some um, roller skates which I love these I love using roller skates for shoots so this will be really fun to use in photo shoot we have more our generation stuff. Wow, I couldn't guess that. <clears throat> also, my voice is going away. I'm sorry about that. But this is the That's How I Roll outfit, and it's really cute. It comes with a beanie, a striped shirt, these um, shorts, black tights, Converse looking shoes, and a skateboard. And this outfit, um, if you don't want to like keep it together, is going to be really good for a mix and match. Next, I got the Soda Pop Sweetheart outfit, which I love so much. It's like a little waitress outfit, and it comes with roller skates as well, and um, it goes with another one of my gifts, which I'll get to at the end of this video because it's like a big gift. Next, we have the Flower Power outfit, which I love this outfit. I think it's so cute. I especially love that skirt. So adorable, but I really, really like this outfit, but it comes with a headband, an off-the-shoulder top, a skirt, tights, and these shoes. I was about to say clocks for some reason. And then we have the pretty shimmery outfit and it's so cute. I love the cardigan because I love that color. But it just comes with a yellow cardigan, a skirt, shoes, a purse, and I guess those are hair clips. I'm not really sure. But very, very cute. And then we have the Our Generation what's it called? Master Baker set and I'm so excited about this. I think this is adorable. But it comes with like a rolling pin, a hat, 
an apron. There's a scale right here. This is a jar filled with like Oreo type cookies. Cookies with a cookie tray. Eggs, which I love. Um, cookie cutters. Uh, cookies with cookie cutter. Brownies, measuring spoons, um, a mixer, and just all kinds of stuff. And the mixer has a timer that really works. Sugar flour, you know, everything. And I think this is adorable. I got a lot of cooking stuff because I love fake food. My favorite thing for my dolls is fake food. I love getting fake food for them. <laughs> so now I'm going to move into the American Girl stuff that I got besides, you know, my dolls. So first, this is the blender and milkshake set and I'll show you guys what's in it. This is the blender and the knob moves but it doesn't do anything. But the milkshake part pops off. So it's like a little drink. This is the ice cream box. It's just a cardboard box, like there's nothing in it, which is kind of disappointing, but, you know, it, I don't really mind that much. It was really cute. Then we have an ice cream ice cream scooper for your invisible ice cream. You have a milkshake. You have another milkshake. And then you have some chocolate syrup to go with all of that. So next we have Julie's snack set and I'm so excited about this because I really wanted this but I didn't ask for it for some reason. So first we have these stuffed monkeys that are hugging each other. I don't know why it's still in the plastic but it is. Next we have some deviled eggs. They're all stuck together but I don't really care. Next we have these paper plates and they're in like these flower plate holders and I think these are really really cute and really 70s. Then we have some peanut butter and celery, which I really want to try now because I wonder if that would be tasty or not. Then we have some Jiffy Pop. We have my favorite piece of the set, which is the banana phone. I think it's so cute. It has a cord and the dial actually rotates and works. So then we have this drink in an owl cup. It's orangey, um, so it could be like Fanta, although it's not bubbly. I don't know what it is. Just an orange drink. And the straw turns. And lastly, we have this drink, which I have no idea what it is, but it looks really good. Next, we have the, it's called the Slow Cooker Set, but I call it the Crock-Pot Set. And y'all, I wanted this so bad. I've been asking for this since, like, May. Like, I want this, or I want this so bad. So first, we have the Crock-Pot, which is so cute. This knob turns, but obviously it doesn't do anything, so it's not a real Crock-Pot. But here's the lid. You can open it, and it comes with grilled chicken, which I think looks so cute. It's another piece of grilled chicken. And it also oops, comes with two pieces or two lumps of broccoli. And then also this part of the crock pot comes out just like a real crock pot, which I think is a nice addition. Two cups of milk or almond milk if you're vegan, <laughs> whatever you want it to be. Next you have two plates. Two pink napkins, which are inside out, yeah. Two pink napkins and a pot holder, some tongs, two forks, some barbecue sauce, two fruit bowls, which are like in an orange peel, which I think is really cool. A little thing of butter, two rolls, two little plates, and then lastly, we have a butter knife. Okay, I have to hurry this video up because I need to leave in like 30 minutes, <laughs> but um, next I got the retired My American Girl school backpack set. This is what it looks like. Like I said, it's retired, and inside it came with a science textbook, a notebook, a water bottle. There's three of these like mechanical pencils inside. Next I got Addie's lunch pail. It comes with her lunch pail and it has this like floral pattern and the top pops off. It comes with these cookies that spell out love. These grapes. Uh, this, I don't, ah, I don't know what to call it. I know, I feel, I know what it's called but the word's not coming to me. And this napkin. Next we have Julie's maxi dress. I think it's called the mix and match dress. I don't know. So this is the dress. It's just a maxi dress. No shoulders. It just ties in the back. But it just goes like this. And I wanted this so bad. I, th I thought it was so cute for the longest time. And I'm so... It comes with this, which I'm pretty sure this is like a headband of some sort. Or you like wrap it around your waist. I'm not really sure. This bracelet. 
the or this this might be a necklace I'm not really sure this bracelet and these sandals and then next we have Addie's school outfit so we have the skirt the top and these hair bows which stick in her hair next I got Rebecca's ch uh, director chair which I've been wanting forever <laughs> I've been wanting this since I was like since it first came out honestly um, since I was little but um, I never got it but I've been wanting it so bad because I've I want to be a director, so I'm so excited to have it now. The director chair, and it just folds up. The director, like, shut up, time to film, <laughs> little shouty thing, I don't know what to call it. A director's board. It also comes with tickets. Comes with all of these, like, boards. There's even more of them down here, but they're, like, title slides um, for silent movies. So it just puts all the dialogue on there. A script and the script actually matches the dialogue on the dialogue cards which I think is kind of cool this comes with a moving picture magazine and it just has all that fun stuff and then lastly it comes with a film poster and I think this is one of the cutest sets American Girl has ever released I love this set so much and then next we have a pet and it's a funky German Shepherd pet house set <laughs> I don't know, that's just what it's called. There's the German Shepherd, and then it comes with a little magnetic toy for him to put in his mouth, and a food bowl and water bowl. So next, I got the retired American Girl fondue set, and I was so surprised whenever I opened this because I wasn't expecting to get it at all, because the fondue set is so hard to find, and I've been wanting the fondue set for so long because I want to make a skit involving fondue set and my mom actually found it and I was so shocked. This looks like spices to me but my mom said it's supposed to be like the fire so this is the post where you like put the fondue on it for it to melt. This is the fondue pot and these are like the fondue sticks so it comes with strawberries and apples. It also comes with the lid to the fondue pot, some napkins, my mom said that this does not belong to the fondue set and the seller just like threw it in there, <laughs> but this thing. And it also comes with this like placemat. Next we have this thing which I'm so excited about. <laughs> it's a bunch of fake food! So I'm going to have to run through this because again I'm running out of time. Get a bunch of watermelons. Just a bunch, a bunch of produce. Look at all that. A crate full of more ugh, more produce, a loaf of bread, and a basket, a little uh, bowl, plate, gingerbread men, and like cut out gingerbread men, <clears throat> eggs, a cup of orange juice. A piece of toast and scrambled eggs, a cucumber, an apple, a thing of cereal which is so cute, and then just some bowls. Ah. Next we have a bag just filled with doll clothes because I'm running out of time on my SD card I'm not going to go through all of them but I mean like we have like dresses and this, there's a crinoline, Marie Grace's outfit, just a ton, a ton of doll clothes which you guys will be seeing in my videos and my pictures. So the next three things I have to talk about, um, I'm just going to insert clips because I don't have them with me because they're kind of big to bring into my room. But I got the My Life As Remote Control car, um, and it's so cool, so I'm going to insert some videos of Francine <laughs> driving in the car, um, but they're really cool. It's really cool and really fun and kind of funny to see my doll zoom around my yard. And then next I got the Our Generation like laundry set, and I'm so excited about this because um, I've been wanting it for so long and it's so cute. And the laundry machine, the washing machine and the drying machine apparently work. So I'm really excited. Um, and then lastly, I got the Art Generation Diner, which I'm so excited about because like I said earlier, my favorite thing is 
fake food and there's so much fake food in that thing and it's so cute and so adorable i'm so excited to make videos with it and pick, take pictures in it so yeah Okay, so I'm literally an idiot and I forgot to show you guys that I also got the American Girl Ultimate Visual Guide, which is the book that I'm showing right now on the screen. And I got a hair pick for my dolls, a hairbrush for my dolls, a mini suitcase for my dolls, and a mini Jane Austen book for my dolls. But that's everything. So hope you guys enjoyed my What I Got for Christmas haul. Again, if you guys would like to see um, a part two to this Christmas haul and you guys want to see what I like human stuff for myself that I got for Christmas like not doll stuff um just leave a comment down below and I will be sure to do that in the next couple of days um so yeah again I hope you guys enjoyed this Christmas haul and I hope you guys had a great holiday or just a great day if you don't celebrate and I hope you guys have a great 2017 bye guys